This is Project Sea of Green. No, welcome everybody to Project Sea of Green. Cause Link's in green, and we're on the sea. But we're getting out of the sea right now. This is the Wind Waker, and I'm Cow's Crazy. We're back here. We're home. We're home. Oh my God, Grandma! Grandma! Oh, Grandma! Let's go see Grandma. What's Grandma up to today? Oh, she's up and about today. She's not sick and all sad. Look at, look at, look at Grandma. Look at Grandma. Look at Grandma. What? Can we not? No, can we not? No, we cannot. Oh, I want to go in the first person mode and really look at Grandma. That would have been awesome. What? No. No, we can't. Can't go in the first person mode inside? That sucks. Cows? Whenever you have an empty bottle, you'll just bring it straight to Grandma. I'll pee in it, and I'll give it back to you. <laughs> I can make some more soup whenever you like, but I also do like to pee in bottles. It's lots of fun. By the way, my soup is also yellow. Did you notice that? Makes you think, doesn't it? Hmm. Got some nice pictures over here. You can kind of see that's Link and Ariel there. Got that soup going on. I think she has more pictures of. Oh, hold on. No. Who the hell's that? Is that like supposed to be a baby picture up there, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. Wonder whatever happened to Link's parents. Link never has any parents, it's always an uncle or something. Seriously. This poor kid's been orphaned over his life so many times. Well, his many lives. But anyways, let's get back to the main reason we're here. We're here for Ziggy Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Is that you, cows? Well, it looks as though you're safe. That's good to know. Ever since you left, our lovely island has become a hor- It has a horrible place to live. Every night now, when the sun disappears, vile monsters appear and tear across the island, causing havoc. It's frightening. So frightening. Oh, well, that's a shame. But we're here for Ziggy Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Cows, you made it back! Isn't our pig just mind-bogglingly huge? We caught him after you left the island. But who knew he'd get so big? I did. Even if I wanted to take him out for a walk, he's too heavy now. That it's all I can do is just to heave him over the fence. Say, cows, you look pretty strapping. I bet you could lift him. Could you do me a favor and take this guy for a walk? Walk a pig? So, we actually need the pig. So let's pick him up. And we can only do this by the power of the power gloves. Oh, a well, wing, I mean. Not the power glove, because the power glove, it's so bad. But anyways, take Ziggy Pig. Oh my god, we walked so slow too with him. Oh, look at Piggy. Oh, Piggy fell to the ground. But we'll pick him back, right back up. Kind of a, I don't, I, I don't see many black pigs around. I think I've seen one before. To be honest with you, but they're pretty rare. Or maybe I'm just imagining it. Maybe I'm just always remembering this pig from the Wind Waker, and I think that somehow in my mind I've actually seen a real black pig. But it's a, it's not the traditional color. That's for sure. Not that I'm trying to be pig racist here or anything. I like how we carry him upside down. <laughs> like, look at that pig. His, his fucking legs are in the air. <laughs> oh, boy. 
That's how I like it. You know, I like my pigs the same way I like my women. On their backs and with their legs in the air. What? What? Huh? Um. So anyways, you carry this big pig over here. And there's these two watches of nasty, I don't know, dirt or something. Anyways, you want to throw the piggy down here. And you want to throw some bait down on this dirt. And he should eat it all up. I think, oh, maybe I just fucked that up. I did fuck that up, didn't I? Oh, I did fuck that up. Nope. Whoops. Wrong buttons. Keep pushing the wrong button. Luckily, I did bring more bait along. Okay, let's try this again. Here, piggy. Piggy. Right there. Piggy. Are you kidding me, piggy? This is why you bought a lot of bait. He's just gonna ignore it. I thought he would have came by and really paid attention here. Okay, piggy. Right there. Get. Get it. Get that bait. Now dig! Yes! Dig! And look at that! Look what he dug up for us! You got another piece of my heart now, baby! Alright. So, we got another piece of that heart. We don't really need the pig anymore, but... I like to torture the pig. Quite a lot, actually. Let's go for a walk with this pig. Let's go, piggy. We're going for a walk. Let's go, piggy. Let's go. Let's go, piggy. Let's go, ziggy piggy. Let's go, piggy. Let's go, ziggy piggy. Zig, zig, zig. Ziggy, ziggy, ziggy piggy. Squirm all you want. There's nothing you can do about it. I'm going to get you to where I want to go. And there's nothing... You can do about it, Piggy. You are in the palm of my hands. I am the all-powerful Link. And I will take you where I want to take you. Even though it's probably going to take a very long time to get there. I think you can see where we're going. <laughs> and you can probably see what I have in mind. Maybe. But not to bore you to death, I'll just meet you at the top of the mountain. How about that? Yeah, okay, moo. Ziggy Piggy, Ziggy Piggy. <laughs> Here we are, we're at the top of the mountain. Oh, isn't that a shame? That's just a crying shame that somebody's put the bridge out. Wow, that's just, well, nobody likes that. Do you know what? That pig might land on that rock over there. I'm not <laughs> Let's just be honest. You all know what I'm going to do. <laughs> so let's go over here. I don't think there's a rock here, right? Alright, and... Goodbye, piggy! <laughs> Kick the camera, right? <laughs> time one more time instant replay look at that piggy go look at that piggy fly Woo! <laughs> oh, that was <laughs> that was worth every penny <laughs> anyways let's jump off myself now Oh, oh boy! <laughs> oh. When pigs fly, <laughs> that's just good stuff. Wow, Wait, what is she up to? Can I knock that off her head and like piss her off? Yeah, okay, I know all about the monsters, but we're not here for that. We're here. <laughs> uh, piggy, we're not here to do your challenge again. We want to. We have brought you these mighty night crests, ten of them to be exact. <gasps> what? 
Why? That is a knight's crest! Yes, I am the champion of the world! WWE champion! How many of those do you have? I have 10 titles. I own 10 championships. Then I suppose the time has come for me to speak to you about the crest. The knight's crest is the symbol of the courageous knight. But not just anyone can gather them, no! It takes a soul who possesses not only power, but wisdom and courage as well. Um, okay, I guess. Um, power, wisdom, courage. Sounds familiar. Hmm. Any courageous soul who gathers ten of these crests can learn a powerful new sword technique. Both my brother and I dreamt of learning this technique in our youth. We worked so hard to collect the crests, but it took many long years and adventures beyond count before we even approached finding ten of them, and we both grew old. It appears you have enough might, uh, might to learn that technique now. Perhaps, just perhaps, you can master it. Very good, cows. Heed my words. I said heed them, damn it! Take one flying! <laughs> Hold the B button to build up power, and then release it! Come at me, brah! Now! Do it! So you wanna hold the B button and look at this. Look at that! Look at that! Look at it glow! And then... Oh boy. Link just goes crazy. See his eyes while he's going around and around like that? Wow. You learned the hurricane spin! Hold B to build up power. Yeah, it's very easy to remember. And you just go crazy. But it, it does consume your magic power. Uh, oh, oh, look look at him cry. Oh, my. <laughs> Amazing, cow. You did it. You have mastered the hurricane spin. At last, you have made our long-held dream come true. Oh, the joy for tears. They won't stop. I thought my tears had dried up long ago. There is nothing left for me to teach you. I am certain now that you will save your sister Ariel and bring her home to Outset. I, I already saved her. I don't know how I got here home before she did. She's supposed to be on a pirate ship somewhere, which we'll never see again. Don't know where she is. Yeah, I'm sure she's okay though. She's just with some really large grown men, but I, I'm sure she's, I'm sure she's just fine. But anyways, now that we have the power of the power bracelet, let's uh, use it for some more. And do you know what? He's coming in to the shop right now. Let's go and buy some stuff, actually. We do need some money, though. But I do want to buy, too. Got to buy, buy, buy. Oh boy. I'm almost out of bait. I do need to buy, buy, buy. Get to buy, buy, buy. Buy. Buy, buy. I need to buy. Buy. Buy, buy, buy. Thank you. You're welcome! Thank you! Put a shirt on! Alright. No, I don't want to buy anymore. Goodbye! I'm trying to get enough money here. You're making me waste my money instead of gain my money. Well, let's continue on to the next island, which is just off to the east here. And this is actually the next island. Well, if you could see my map, you would see that this one is glowing and it has a ring around it. So this is the actual next story progression island. This is where we want to go. Now, we've been here before, but we weren't able to do much last time we were here. Other than, I don't know, collect some stuff. Yeah. We are collecting stuff. Stuff with a bird. Remember we had the bird fly around? Yeah, that's what we did. 
Anyways, we're back here again. There's his head here. Let's get some head. Yeah. That's why there was that big head when we got the ring. To teach us that we could pick up head. Head. We got head. Why do we have to throw it? Why can't we just put it down gently? Like somebody went to great lengths. You know, they could have just left this a really heavy rock. But they went to great lengths to turn around and like carve out this head. A very sad face. And now we're just going to go and destroy the work of art like that. Let's just... You're an asshole! He's an asshole! What do we got inside here? Ooh, Triforce. Looks like some symbols. Down, down. Pause, right, left, pause. Is that a pause? I said, I think that's a pause. It's a beat pause. So let's see what we can do here. There appear to be markings. Hmm. Alright. Alright, well, we could do that. That's a 6 4 time, though. Whoops. Wow, we've not. I don't think we've used one yet, a 6 4 time. So it's, you gotta hold it to the right, and let's get it going here. We got. There we go. Play that song. What a melody. You learned the Earth God's lyric. The Earth God. The God of the Earth. <gasps> oh, great hero. Chosen by the Master Sword. My name is Laruto. I am a Zora Sage. For an age, I offered my prayers here in the Earth Temple, praying that the power to repel evil would ever remain within the Master Sword. And yet, unfortunately, Due to Ganondorf's eatable designs, the Master Sword you hold has lost this power. After his defeat at the hands of the Hero of Time, Ganondorf was sealed away, but not for all time. He was revived, and he returned to Hyrule in a Red Wrath. I thought he was going to come in a blue one, or maybe a green one, or how about a nice little fancy purple one with polka dots? But no, no, it had to be a red wrath. He attacked this temple and stole my soul. He thought this was demon souls, maybe, and that's why he needed to take the souls. And then it became Dark Souls, and then Dark Souls 2, and each game got harder and harder, but now I'm just going off on a tangent. He knew he had to remove the power contained in the Enchanted Blade. In order to return the power to repel evil to your sword, you must find another to take my steed in this temple and ask the gods for their assistance. You must find the one who carries on my bloodline, the one who holds this sacred instrument. <gasps> Nothing can stop the flow of time or the passing of generations, but the fate carried within my bloodline ensures endures endures the ravages of all the years it survives the song you just conducted is the one that will open the eyes of the new sage and awaken within that sage the melody that will carry our prayers to the gods the door that blocks your way will only open when the sage plays that song. May the winds of fortune blow with you.
So I have to find some other schmuck to like come with me to this temple, play the song in front of the door, and then sit inside the temple and pray to the gods until they die that my sword will have power to defeat Ganondorf. That sounds like it sucks. <laughs> I would not want to be a sage. That's like the worst life you could ever imagine. You just sit there and you pray every day. You got to pray! Pray! Yeah! You got to pray just to make it today. You got to pray! Pray! You've got to pray just to make it today. And we'll try to make it and find that sage in the next episode. Until then, everybody, I've been Cows Crazy. Please subscribe. Please leave a comment below. And of course, boo!